The Lutheran St. Paul's Church is the only purely German-speaking parish left over of formerly over 20 in New York City. Founded in 1841, the foundation stone of the first St. Paul's Church near 15th Street and 6th Avenue was laid in October 1842. A few months later the church was already in use. Because of the continuing flow of immigrants from Germany, the parish soon outgrew the church. On the 6th of May 1860, the last service in the first church was held. Then it was torn down and rebuilt with approximately 1,000 seats. On March the 20th, 1861, the new church was handed over to the congregation. But soon the newly constructed elevated train on 14th Street introduced noise, which grew so intolerable that the church needed to move again. A new location was found in 22nd Street in 1897. The old church was sold for 190,000 US dollars. On July the 4th, 1897, Cornerstone was laid. After only seven months, on February the 13th, 1898, the church was inaugurated and was paid for the last cent. All major world events are reflected in the history of the parish. 1923, the year of hyperinflation in Germany, more than 100,000 German immigrants arrived in the United States. 1941, after Germany declared war on the United States, the German language church newsletter was banned and many church members were interned until 1947. Ten months after the surrender of Germany, the St. Paul's Parish started the initiative Labour of Love, German Emergency Relief of the Lutheran Church. Over 6,000 pounds of clothing and 10,500 US dollars were collected and sent to Germany to support the population. The empathy and willingness to help resulted not only in relief for Germans, but also welded the St. Paul's community together. A boom time with increasing numbers of German immigrants. From 1950 to 1960, about 600,000 gave the St. Paul's Church a new lease.